My favorite part of my trip was dropping my camera in Lake Blit. No, no, I'm kidding. Um, it was definitely cliff jumping and pool. Like, I think that's one of the most exhilarating things I've done, like my whole entire life. Like, who jumps off a cliff into the water? It was, it was really high and really scary at first, but once you did it, it was like perfect and it was awesome. And then I kept doing it over and over again. Um, I would say the best part of my trip um, would be cliff diving in Pula, Croatia, because it's something I would never have done if I weren't there. So the sightseeing was like amazing. It's like you don't see things here that you see over there because it was so like beautiful like and like untouched. Like there's not like a lot of like construction going on. Everything was just like naturally beautiful. It was awesome. It was good. It's incredible. There's nothing in America like there is overseas. Um, Venice was awesome. Pula, my favorite place because it was on the beach. The water was so clear. Um, Slovenia was awesome, big mountains, everything was just incredible. Oh my god, I vlogged about it and I almost cried. It was, that's like something you think, oh, it's just a jersey, but like once you put it on, you're like, oh my gosh, like I'm representing the United States, like a whole country is like on my back right now. Like that's what you're representing and it means, it means a lot. Uh, it was insane. I've never done something like that before. It was really cool. We tried to take lots of pictures. <laughs> it was really amazing. Everyone was like, oh, Americans. <laughs> um, the ball itself was very light. It floated a lot more. Um, it just floats differently. It feels different. It's just a different ball to play with. So you have to get used to like serving it and passing it. And then the second difference is that they play they don't play as fast tempo as us. They have like more higher balls to the outside, but this has helped me a lot because I haven't played in like a real game in over a year. So it helps because I've, it prepares me for the games that I'm going to play just because I learned so many things. Only being over there 10 days, you learn how to like work with people you never worked with. You learn different coaching styles, different everything. So it, it like fixes things and everything and it makes it, it makes it a lot better. I'm really excited for next season now. I'm, I think I'm super prepared. Some schools can't do anything like this. Um, so it's awesome that they're trying to get two girls to go every year. Um, I would suggest doing it to anyone if you ever get the time. I think this says a lot. This experience says a lot about our program because this shows that we're growing as a program and as a team and that like we're we're good enough to be sent over to Europe to represent the United States and I think that's the biggest statement that like two girls from Stony Brook volleyball just went overseas to you to represent the United States and I, that's that in itself is huge and it's just the representation of the university and athletics that we're just growing and we're becoming something that's going to be a force to rec be reckoned with in the near future